uh, our program is about giving every person hope. And today we want to know how to manage stress and how to heal your life and our life. My name is Mubua Kimani. I'm ongoing psychology classes as a counselor. And uh, uh, also, I have met different types of people, giving them counseling and talking to them. And I have come to realize that most other people who are going through stress. And that's why today I want us to discuss about stress. And in the whole world, we are facing this. And it's important we discuss it today. And that's why it is on our program how to manage stress and heal your life from stress. Uh, first of all, I would like us to discuss and define stress. What is stress? Stress is the perception of physical or psychological threat. Stress is how you perceive what happens. And that's why we are having a stress. That is the definition of stress. And I take stress as if it's a notion, how a notion wave, the wave in a notion, if you're not prepared, every wave is a disaster in a notion. When you're in a notion, every wave is a disaster. And that's stress. Everything which is happening in your life, everything which is stressing you, that's stress. Everything which is happening in your life, uh, the difficulties you are in, and the things you are thinking about, that is stress. And if you are not able to handle them well, they are becoming as if it is a wave in a notion that you may be taken by the water. And that is those waves, the stress, the difficulties, the suffering, and the things which are in your mind right now, and the things which are disturbing you right now, they might take you away. And it is very important to know exactly how we are going to handle the situations we are facing in our lives. Uh, my dear listeners, this, is thing, this thing is happening and it is important we tackle it deeply so that we may help one another and so that we may be able to overcome this stress. What happens when you feel psychological or emotional threatened? Uh, for example, maybe you are going for a walk and you find there is jam. Uh, maybe you are going for an appointment and something happened, you are seeing as if you will be late. Or maybe I was coming to attend this program and maybe I was caught up somewhere. And I'm seeing my time for the listeners and myself, I cannot manage this. How do you handle such situations? And uh, maybe you're traveling outside country and you feel you're missing your fright. How do you handle that? That's stress. But how do you handle that situation you are in? Maybe you feel somebody doesn't love you. You are just feeling like you are not loved. How do you handle that? Because that is stress. And I will like to say this. Stress is imagination. You are trying to imagine things which are not there. Things which are... You, yourself, you're not in those things, but you're trying to imagine somebody doesn't love me. That is imagination. You're trying to imagine there is jam. You'll not get in to job, to your work uh, on time. That is the imagination and it is giving you stress. And imagination is creativity. We create. Imagination is creativity. We are trying to create things. And those things we create, they are... The, the worst of imagination is stress. When we imagine, it becomes stress. And how do we handle all of these things? Because we are all human beings. How do we tackle these? How do we handle them? Maybe right now, your things are good. But when you start thinking that the things are going, you are now imagining things are going to be worse. 
you are anxious about not having to deal with your situation, future, and that is fear. And also fear is stress. And actually, I want her to describe about the fear and the anger, the shame and the guilty. We need to know exactly how to handle all these being called stress. And that's why we are going to tackle everything and then we as listeners, we decide what exactly we want with our lives because the things we are facing, mostly they are not helping us. Even if you are keeping on, uh, maybe resent having resentment, uh, and that's why we are discussing this in deeper. We need to exactly understand what is stress and we need to understand and uh, be able to overcome the things this stress brings in our lives. Fear. Fear is the anticipation of something going wrong in the future. That's why we fear. We fear maybe I'll get divorced. We fear maybe I'll not get married. We fear maybe I'll not get a kid. We fear maybe uh, I'll lose my job. We fear maybe my kids will not perform well. That's fear and it is stress. That means we are having something going all wrong in our future. And that's why we are having that fear. You're fearing what people will say about you. That's fear. You're fearing what people talk about you. What are they saying about me? That's fear. And it is more than stress. Uh, if you see, uh, we discuss about anger. Anger is the memory of what was wrong in the past. Maybe somebody did something wrong about you and now you are starting remembering what happened. That is past. Then you're having that anger. And anger brings stress. It's more than, you see, fear, anger. Hostility. Now we discuss about hostility and we are in this, we are trying to manage our stress. It's how to manage our stress and we have to discuss and divine all these things which are making us have this stress. <laughs>